You know, ever since COVID induced lockdowns forced people and companies to change their habit and views towards a traditional 9 to 5 job, a rising trend on social media has been emerged called quiet quitting. Other terms like moonlighting has or have also emerged where employees take advantage of their skills and the internet to work two or more jobs being at the same location and earn more money. But the million dollar question is and has always been is this the end of the traditional 9 to 5 as we know it? Here's our take and we would love to get your opinion so come in the comment section. Do it. The first is the cost factor. For both the employees and the employers the cost factor has changed the game. Now for employees it's not even money alone. It's the time and energy that is saved when you're not stuck in traffic 3 hours a day or have to grind through the day with time wasters around you. You know those people who who hang who used to hang around with you or do still hang around with you in the corners of an office and just speaking needlessly? Yeah. That. People have been reported to be much more efficient and happier working from home. The second is the myth of networking and being around people, you know, those people pleasers. The serious employees who intend to change their lives by upskilling skilling themselves realize that going to an office and networking is an old system that doesn't quite work anymore. Remember the good old days when the employees used to get a Seiko watch after completing 25 years at a firm? Remember? Yeah, that doesn't happen anymore. It's a different game out there with multiple platforms to succeed and a very individualistic approach to the job which leads us to our third point which we call the invincible Indian point so here is out on this it's called the personal brand and attention monetization the latest trend on even the so-called professional networks like LinkedIn which by the way has turned more into well I don't even want to say it is to brand yourself and Put yourself out there. The idea is to make your expertise or skill, which is your job skill, let's just say, and to monetize it in as many ways as possible. So let's say if you are into HR, you could make content that's centric around HR and tell people the facts they need to do for when they have to give up a new job interview or when they have to apply for jobs or let's say, you know, how they can be business partners and things like that that can actually help people and you as well being the con being the creator behind that and the last point is artificial intelligence and other cutting edge technology which has turned the tables for the job market with a lot of jobs on the verge of automation forcing the employees to adapt to the new reality but there's a hidden opportunity in all of this that we talk about here at invincible indian all the bloody time that's technology is a tool for everyone not just for companies let me say it again Technology is a tool for everyone and not just companies. People have started to realize this and as a result, the shift into freelancing and later into agency model is taking place faster than you think. We at Invincible Indian are happy about it. These trends align with our goal of time, money and location freedom and we are committed to help you as many as you can to reach your goals in the best, in the fastest way possible without getting into all those clickbait schemes that YouTube is famous for.